Hi there, in this video I'm going to show you how you can easily create a Microsoft Teams meeting using Outlook on the web. Uh, for doing so, here I am in Outlook on the web in Office 365, so I'm going to create a new meeting just by uh, doing double click in one of the dates of the next week. And uh, yeah, I can start uh, typing the details for uh, for this meeting, as you can see here, we have the modern experience for um, Outlook on the web, what includes not only mail, but also calendar, and contacts, and tasks. So, yes, imagine we are having a meeting where we will have some coffee. Uh, yeah, this is actually uh, where you can see some of the new cool experience you have in the UI, uh, such as if we type ca uh, coffee, we are going to have um, just the symbol of a cup of coffee, so coffee break. This is the name of the meeting we are going to have in Teams. So everyone that is attending the meeting is going to have a coffee and doing whatever he or she wants to do. But the important thing here is that we are going to invite some people, such as Dave, Alex, and so on. So we can specify also the start time that is going to be 9 in the morning. The meeting is going to um, uh, last only half an hour. Uh, yeah, we have we can add a location or room, and then here we have the new theme uh, when creating in a meeting invite, a meeting invite uh, directly from Outlook on the web. We can specify that this is going to be a Teams meeting, so we uh, just uh, can enable the switch. Here we go, and what is going to happen is that as soon as we send the meeting invite, uh, we are going to uh, have added the Teams meeting URL in the body of the a meeting request. So we can send. Here we go. And if you open this meeting request again uh, from Outlook on the web, this is what I need to do now. Let's see if I'm able to do that. Okay, since this is a new interf uh, user interface, sometimes you uh, can have some kind of problems such as not, able, not being able to open the a meeting. But yeah, there are always tricks to accomplish what you need. So uh, I can try to open again. Something is not working. Yeah. So let's try again to open. OK. By day. Yeah. So I'm going to refresh the calendar view. So I'm able to open just this meeting, something I'm not able to do now. I know, no, it's a problem of uh, just the uh, Outlook on the web, or it's a problem of my device, yeah, whatever. But uh, the idea is I want to open this uh, meeting, and I have to do this just in a moment. So uh, stay with me. Yeah, you see it's refreshing. I think it's also related with my surface. Um, yeah, that I'm recording the video with Cantasia, so yeah. Uh, Sadly, this is a Surface Pro 3 that you know is maybe a little bit old for doing many things. Uh, so from time to time, I see this kind of uh, of problems. So yeah, we are going to go back. Okay, I think it's coming. Going to go back to uh, to the mail. I'm going to try to open again the calendar. Okay, I think I'm going to uh, to pause uh, to pause for a moment uh, the video so I'm sure that uh, yeah we, I can open this correctly. So let's pause and I will come back. Okay, here I am again. So finally, uh, I ended open uh, opening the calendar uh, using uh, Microsoft Edge instead of using Google Chrome. That apparently is a problem with uh, Google Chrome. So uh, here I have uh, the meeting request I was creating before. So I can just double, double click on there or just a simple click. So I have this uh, very nice pop up uh, where I can see some of the details of uh, this meeting request. And as you can see here, I have a join Teams meeting. That is what I, I was expecting. And I can expand the view. Here we go, and as you can see here, as a consequence of uh, selecting that this is a Teams meeting, I have added, uh, by the uh, directly added, this Join Microsoft Teams meeting in the body of the meeting request. So I can click on Edit the meeting request. Yep, yeah. and yes, you are still seeing this in the body of the meeting request. And that's all. Um, 
So uh, I hope you have found, found this video interesting. Um, yeah, as expected, uh, this is actually a very nice feature. So the ability to be able to create a Microsoft Teams meeting directly in Outlook on the web is very cool. So uh, yeah, I, uh, as I say, uh, I hope you have found this video interesting. And yeah, talk to you, talk to you soon. Bye bye.